Hello there, welcome. My name is Lauren Weibert. I'm a Proctor Gallagher consultant and I help teams and individuals win big. Uh, wanted to share with you today a little excerpt from one of the most phenomenal books on the planet. It's Think and Grow Rich and it was written by Napoleon Hill in 1937. I'm going to be doing a few videos with excerpts from this book because there are so many really great little bits and pieces of information uh, that can help so many people. So I'm going to be sharing those over time. But this book is known for creating hundreds, thousands, if not millions of millionaires. Um, Napoleon Hill, when he wrote this book, he was challenged and commissioned by Andrew Carnegie, uh, the wealthiest man in the world at the time, um, to interview uh, 500 of the world's most successful people. And once he did that, he compiled all of that information and put it into this book. And these are the, the things that he found out while he was doing that. So uh, the first excerpt that I wanted to share with you is called the self-confidence formula. And Napoleon suggests reading this out loud to yourself at least once a day. Um, which I am making a point to do. My mentor, Bob Proctor, uh, has also read and studied this book every day for the past somewhere around 60 years at the time that I'm making this video. Um, so I thought it would be great to put this on a YouTube and that way if you're driving or getting ready, um, you know, or you're not able to actually read it from the physical copy of the book, um, that you would have a copy of it here on my channel. So, away we go. This is the self-confidence formula from Napoleon Hill's Think and Grow Rich. First, I know that I have the ability to achieve the object of my definite purpose in life. Therefore, I demand of myself persistent, continuous action toward its attainment, and I here and now promise to render such action. Second, I realize the dominating thoughts of my mind will eventually reproduce themselves in outward physical action and gradually transform themselves into physical reality. Therefore, I will concentrate my thoughts for 30 minutes daily upon the task of thinking of the person I intend to become, thereby creating in my mind a clear mental picture of that person. Third. I know through the principle of auto-suggestion, any desire that I persistently hold in my mind will eventually seek expression through some practical means of attaining the object back of it. Therefore, I will devote 10 minutes daily to demanding of myself the development of self-confidence. Fourth, I have clearly written down a description of my definite chief aim in life and I will never stop trying until I shall have developed sufficient self-confidence for its attainment. Fifth, I fully realize that no wealth or position can long endure unless built upon truth and justice. Therefore, I will engage in no transaction which does not benefit all whom it affects. I will succeed by attracting to myself the forces I wish to use and the cooperation of other people. I will induce others to serve me because of my willingness to serve others. I will eliminate hatred, envy, jealousy, selfishness, and cynicism by developing love for all humanity because I know that a negative attitude towards others can never bring me success. I will cause others to believe in me because I will believe in them and in myself. I will sign my name to this formula, commit it to memory, and repeat it aloud once a day with full faith that it will gradually influence my thoughts and actions so that I will become a self-reliant and successful person. So there you have that. It's going to be embedded forever in time on the wonderful YouTube. So thank you so much for joining me and I will be putting up lots and lots more of these. And I am um, 
intending that this will be helpful to so many of you as I know that it has been to me. Thank you. Talk to you soon.